Well, first of all, you look lovely. Tell me, how did you decide this is what you wanted to wear to Palm Springs? Um, well, I put it on <laughs> and, and it was um, long sleeved, which was nice for being outside in this chilly weather. Yeah. But there's also a little bit of sneak peek I interest. It. It's so, so um, I don't know, it just felt fun. It's so funny because I talked to you in the summer when Barbie was first premiering. And here we are in the new year celebrating the movie at the Palm Springs International Film Festival. Plus nine Golden Globe nominations and 18 Critics' Choice nominations, including one for yourself. When you guys were making this, did you ever imagine that'd be part of the award circuit conversation? No, not really. I mean, that wasn't, I, I don't, I wasn't thinking ahead right. that far. I mean, I think I thought of as far ahead as, um, you know, excited for the audiences to watch the movie. You know, we were in our little bubble making it for months and months um, and knowing that it was special and fun and unique and just really anticipating that moment when the audiences got to finally, you know, see this incredibly unexpected vision yeah. that Greta had for this world. And someone for you, you know, obviously you've been in this industry for so long and you've been a part of such important projects and stories, but seeing the impact and the global reach this has done, are you pinching yourself that you've even got to be a part of it? Yeah, it's hard to really um, comprehend, yeah. you know, something as global as this has been and, um, you know, the, the largest film that Warner Brothers has made in the history of Warner Brothers. It's, right. you know, at a certain point it's like it is kind of pinch me because you can't really like comprehend it. It's like, okay, I get that it's big, yeah. you know, but for me, the, the moments where I really get to feel the impact of it is when I get to like see the reactions of the audiences during a screening, after yeah. a screening where people are really enjoying it and soaking it in and being moved by it. And, you know, it's kind of the bigger it gets, the harder it is to understand, but yeah. then the more intimate your interactions with audience members are, the more the more I can feel the impact of, of the film. Now, you know we love when you and your sisterhood of the Traveling Pants co-stars <laughs> get together, and I know you guys have always supported each other, but the way they showed up for you in support of this film and your performance, how special is that? It was, I mean, they're my girls. Yeah. They're, I feel so incredibly lucky that um, I've had this sisterhood in real life, um, because we all grew up together, and we grew up in the same industry and we've all seen each other through so many life moments and career moments and ups and downs and um, to, to, to have a friendship 20 years later um, that is really incredibly um, supportive and meaningful it, it just feels like such a gift and I love them each so deeply and and there is something about like when our forces combine. <laughs> it breaks the internet. I know, you know, I know, that's so weird. I just mean like our energy goes oh. off the charts. Like I when the it. four of us are in the same room, we're like, it's like we're back on the set of the first movie and we never stop talking over each other or, you know, it's like the exact same dynamic we started 20 years ago. I was gonna say next year marks 20 years since yeah. Sisterhood. Have you guys talked about how you might celebrate that milestone? No, no, but that's a good idea. I think we should have a 20 year celebration. Something.